Bandito Bodega, the restaurant, opened in February 2017, but the popularity of the menu had already been well established by the Bandito Burrito food truck. Each enterprise supports the other. I love having the truck, you know, the truck feeds off this, it's the, the restaurant gives a place a truck to work out of, um, you know, while advertising for us around town, looking forward to, you know, hopefully expanding, um, you know, whether that's another food truck or, or another restaurant or a bar or something like that, you know. Now, I was just absolutely intrigued by the idea of a collard and bacon quesadilla. Doesn't that sound great? Oh, got melted cheese in there and you can kind of dip it in stuff. Oh, 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 oh. I absolutely love that. That's the best quesadilla I've ever tasted in my life. Mm. Both the bodega and the food truck are well known for their substantial burritos, including one known as the Big <clears throat> Burrito, and another featuring the house pomelo cheese along with a dozen other ingredients. Fusion cuisine is common in food trucks, and in this case, the Asian-Mexican fusion is well represented at the restaurant. They do several things with ahi tuna here, so there's part of the Asian influence in this place. This is ahi tuna, rare. There's sticky rice underneath there, some miso spinach, pickled ginger, and an absolutely intriguing very salty, thinly sliced, kind of a pickled radish that's absolutely delicious. Mmm. Oh. Now we've told you that this is sort of a Mexican-Asian fusion and nothing exemplifies that more than their simple Asian taco. Now, Mexican-Asian fusion really revolves around a couple of things. One is cilantro. I've eaten cilantro on the Tibetan plateau of China over yak meat, and, and they serve a lot of it in Mexico, so it's an Asian-Mexican thing right there. The other thing is just a taco, Asian food with some sort of uh, flatbread to hold it up. So that's another fusion element there that makes this work. Mm-hmm. They're also quite well known for their gyoza, which are these little dumplings that have uh, ground pork in there and what they call gnome-grown little tiny mushrooms and other things, plus a nice uh, dipping sauce. Mm. I'm a connoisseur of dumplings. Those are fabulous. Bandito Bodega really does have inventive, high-quality food. You won't be disappointed. Bandito Bodega is at 1609 Friendly Avenue in Greensboro, and they're open for lunch and dinner Tuesday through Saturday, and for lunch only on Sundays. For more information, give them a call at 336-897-7878, or go online to banditobodega.com.